beautiful Salt Lake. This is our buddy Adam. He's hiding. And uh, I was doing some research and I found this place called Chatters, which is supposed to be a carbon copy of In-N-Out Burger. For you guys that have no idea what this fine establishment is, it's called In-N-Out. It's Christian owned. And if you look at like the table design, the umbrellas. So I'm probably gonna order a double double animal style just to see what happens. And uh, let's go check it out. Did you see this? Are you, are you filming? Yeah. <laughs> you can't tell, but it smells just like in and out But I like, I like the uh, Sid the Kid on the wall. Which one should I get? Definitely. Uh, that one. Definitely that one. That one. That's thing I get. This the a Utah thing. <laughs> California theme instead of sports. So that's Lou's meal. Totally different. I don't know what you guys are saying. This place is totally different. Look, there's a baseball player on the wall. Ooh, that's true. They got, yeah, there's sports stuff because you can't really do the California thing and when you're in Utah. Their cups aren't Coke. Show them, show them the verse, Lou. Made in. Nope. Oh, there we go. That's John 316 in a very blurry kind of way. And that. That is why In N Out is better. Yep. We're here in Reno, Nevada. A lot of people have posted things like Sin City and how horrible this place is. But we choose to have fun this way. Whoa! So we're sitting here at Circus Circus. Right here is a game. Right here is what I like to call fishy. I told Lou I really wanted the fishy, but I wasn't willing to play the game. Lou is now getting five dollars. I told him I'd pay him back five bucks if he wins, but if he loses, he's out five bucks. Sorry, Lou. I've learned all of my technique from Chris Gurney. Wait, Lou, let's pray. Last one. Oh! Ah. It's all right. It's Halloween. Uh, Lou bought himself a pretty snazzy Halloween costume, but Joey and I have nothing. We have a show tonight. We're at the only place where we can actually afford costumes. So we're hoping we can find something good. <laughs> this is dumb. All this stuff's like aimed for children. Hey, what do you think of my costume? It's awesome. What, what do you think of mine? I decided to dress up as a Star Trek character because it's only logical. Because I'm a nerd. Live long and prosper. My costume for Halloween was a lot less expensive and has got a lot more reaction out of people. I got Mr. Bird here for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. And uh, got him secured with some green duct tape. He's a great bird. He doesn't ever talk. I uh, dressed up as a tree hugging hippie. Check this out. Protect, preserve, discover, explore. Let's go back to the discover. Who really wants to discover a bear to maul you? What's that about? 
I don't know, you're the one wearing the shirt. <laughs> so we've been on the road for like two months and we're about ready to cross back into the promised land, also known as Oregon. So uh, anyway, I hope you've enjoyed these podcasts and I hope you're